Hi. I'm outside here in the snow. <clears throat> Maybe able to hear the birds sounding out right beside me, but um, my neighbor seems to have started up their uh, tractor. So you'll probably just hear that. I thought it'd be nice and uh, quiet out here, apart from the birds. Uh, but here we have it. And the white pines made ever whiter by the snow and the uh, bamboo as well. Matter of fact, the grass, they're all doing this kind of green and white thing. Has me thinking about the term evergreen and how it really has to do with expectations. And yet those expectations really uh, could have been uh, more wisely developed. I have a little tripod-y thing. I'll see if I can hang this onto the bamboo a little and see how that works. Probably not well, but we try. We do try these things for you, dear viewer. <laughs> the tripod stayed on, but the phone did not stay on the tripod. That's pretty funny. That's okay. This is uh, probably what you're used to with me. So, there's a little version of it hanging in the bamboo. And uh, so, in terms of expectation, you know, evergreen doesn't. Uh, doesn't suggest that people think or ever thought that the uh, that the um, tree would be immortal simply that the tree would be green when other plants are not so it's it's green when it's not expected it's green in the winter that's what an evergreen is but really that presumes an expectation that everything would brown, but when would you develop that expectation? <laughs> I mean, the evergreens were always around. So, the term evergreen kind of makes me think of expectations. And coming in now in this light snow, you can see the grass and the white pines and the bamboo are all still largely green, but being covered in white to different degrees of success. And uh, so I'll stand by this bamboo, do a little bit of a meditation. We're uh, not far from the studio <coughs> here. And that, that will be about expectation, you know. I was confronted with that immediately, thinking to myself, I'll step outside and do a meditation. <coughs> It'll be quiet except for the birds. And then it, neighbor has her tractor going. But right away there's my expectation. And so I'm just going to be standing here in the bamboo feeling the snow come down. Now that it's quieting I can hear the snow Tink, 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 tinking off the bamboo all around me. Like a thousand silent patters. And so I'm standing here, shifting into a meditative state, <clears throat> listening without expectation. Bamboo is known for being so flexible and rebounding. And that fits in with the expectation idea, I think, as well. You know, it's where your expectations diverge with reality that the fracturings begin. And of course, the bamboo, even the piece here is, uh, that the camera is attached to is bent like this. Uh, so the top of it is reaching the ground 
And you'd think maybe the top of the bamboo would have had some expectation of getting towards the sky, or being the highest part of the bamboo at least. But the feeling I get is that there's no expectation. It bends because that's how things are. And now it's bamboo reaching for the ground. So listen with me, not just with your ears, but with your skin, with your heart. Listen to the sound of the world around you. For me, it's these birds. The relatively noisy snow on the desiccated branches and leaves. There's a nice expectation meditation to do with the breath where you slowly fill the body with breath, inhaling. And as you reach the end of your inhalation, <clears throat> your mind will generally shift towards the exhalation to come, maybe with the urgent necessity to exhale. And that's where you can see the birth of expectation. So the idea would be to stay present in the entirety of that inhalation all the way up until it's no longer a thing and the exhalation begins sort of surprises you as your first awareness your first bit of mind connecting to it was when it began in that moment and then of course the same thing goes with the inhalation uh, that follows the end of the very end of the exhalation so it's a nice little expectation meditation to do. I'm going to just do that now with you as I continue to listen. This little tripod thing off the bamboo. I'll show you the bamboo that we were resting on. I know you're looking at the sky now. But there's the, uh, the bamboo grove, and, and here's the uh, branch that we were hanging on, which of course is right reaching towards the ground here. Can you even see? This one heading out, bent into the driveway just from this little bit of snow. You know, this morning it was upright. And uh, I think it's quite amazing how little this snow weighs. And yet the bamboo has responded. And there's the, the white pines along the drive, which are becoming whiter. Anyway, thank you very much. Be safe, meditate, and uh, have some cookies. <laughs>